what is going down everybody it's boy kid here coming at you with another video sorry i've been away for a couple uh, weeks or so been doing lacrosse for 2-0 hell yeah winning some games but uh the coach gave me some free time to ourselves since our game got canceled today because of the weather i got some free time myself so let's do some videos here we're doing a nhl gm mode as hockey kid because you know how we do up in this town go let's put it on name right then and there here we go so i already put the team we're gonna do we're doing the boston bruins my team team that did, failed to make the playoffs uh the top players are rath bergeron and creechie their salary is 64 million eight hundred thirty thousand. players in the organization is 22 and their average age about 26 so we're gonna go boston bruins here my team we're gonna be playing with some salary cap on and our rules and settings are going to be all fine because we're going to be soul mating it anyways. So, uh, yeah, let's get into the game here. So we're going to keep some salary caps on, even though it's going to hurt somebody, hurt some teams here in the cap. <coughs> Excuse me. So, yeah, so we're getting back into, since we have some free time, it's downtime to ourselves, we're going to get into some videos here. All right. And I got I got a couch over the weekend, so I'm sitting in my couch right next to my TV, and I'm so happy I got this couch. All I need now is a better mic, and we should be all set to make some more videos. So, this is EA Sports thing takes forever to load. We'll get into it. So here we are. We are start of the regular seat. We are at the start of the regular season, excuse me, against the Philadelphia Flyers. So we are going to go with our roster. So let us look at our roster. Guys, look at our roster. No, all right, well, let's look at the starting lineup for right now. Starting lines. So for the first line, the assistant coach. Would you like to help? Would you like help keep your life up to date? The assistant coach. No, sure. Why not? We'll have we'll have our assistant coach help us if we need it. So right now we have Lucic, Bergeron, and Marshawn on the first line. We have Smith, Krejci, and Erickson on the second line. Tablet. Soderberg and Paye on the third line and Conley, Kelly and Campbell on the fourth line. So what I want to do is I, I don't want to split up Lucic and Krejci. I want to keep them too. Um, I kind of like the line of having Tablet on the left wing with Bergeron and Marshawn. So that way we have an 86, an 86 2 a forward, a 91 2 a forward and a, and a uh, left wing grinder. Where I want these two lines to put up points, and I want these two lines to kind of play defense. So what I really want for lines is I want these two to score goals, these ones to kind of score goals and play defense, and I want this to be a good defensive line. So since Collie's a sniper, I'm gonna move him up to let's see here. Yeah, I like this because we have a playmaker, a power forward, and a sniper. We're pie. We have all. We have two a fours and a playmaker. So let's move Conley and Paye to a sniper, a two-way forward, and a playmaker on the third line. And then we'll move Campbell to take face-offs. So we have a grinder, a, another grinder, and a two-way forward for playing. So that's why we got our defensive fourth line, our goal scoring and defense, kind of a uh, third line, and our goal scoring first and second line. So now for defense, who do we got here? We got my big boys, Adeno Chara, two-way defender. Offensive defenseman for Dougie Hamilton on the first line. For second line, we got offensive defenseman Tori Krug. And defensive defenseman uh, Carl so uh, Dennis Heidenberg. We also got our defensive defenseman Matt Bartowski. And our defensive defenseman Adam McQuinn. So good, I want to throw in to be on defense. But now, I kind of want two offensive defensemen on the same line just so this line can put up goals. So we're actually going to switch Hamilton and Chara, and we're going to switch Krug and Seidenberg. That way, again, my first line defensively is putting up goals, and these two, and these lines, at least, you know, Chara can shoot, and so can Seidenberg in this game. So, you know, because you take a look at their, um, at their shooting, I mean, Chara's a four and a, a five and a half, and, you well, know, Chara is still five and a half, and so is Seidenberg's a four and a half. So, their shooting is pretty good in this game, but look at Krug's. I mean, Krug's up there with four. Uh, five and a half, and, set, and so is Hamilton. So I'm gonna trust them more with scoring goals, and trust these guys more on kind of a neutral scoring goals and playing defense, and these guys focusing on defense. And for our goaltenders, we have Tuukka Rask and Nicholas Zemberg. 
Uh, so, you know, obviously Rath can get the starting job. For our scratch lines, we have Ryan Spooner and David Pasternak, who will probably get called up sooner or later. For our no lines, we have nobody. Uh, for extras, we have Krejci, Lucci, Hamilton, and Shara for 4-on-4, four four, and Bergeron, Marshawn, and Krug, and Seidenberg for 4-on-4. Four four. For our power play, we have Bergeron, Krejci, Marshawn, with Hamilton and Krug on the back end. Lucci, Schilleberg, and Eriksson with Chara and Seidenberg on the back end. So, right now, I like our, I like our roster right now for our starting lineup. So, we're going to keep it alone for right now. So what we're going to do is we are going to soulmate up to... Let's see here. We're going to soulmate up to the end of the month. So, that is right here. So, we're going to soulmate up to the end of the month and we'll see how our team is doing. Uh, so yeah guys, like I was saying, I had games and practices constantly uh, for like, these couple weeks, so I didn't really have time over the weekend, always got a couple weekends to post anything, so uh, my apologies for that, but I will try to get back into it if I have Sundays off, I will try to start recording for you guys, and hopefully uh, get back into doing YouTube videos. So what I'm going to play for doing for this series is soulmating the games and making trades, and then when we get to the playoffs, I'm gonna uh, my Twitch account got deleted for some reason. Uh, Twitch decided to be be weird and delete my account. So what happened was I didn't realize my account was deleted, so I kept live streaming, but I couldn't, and I wouldn't realize why until I finally realized that my my um my Twitch account was gone. So I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a new Twitch account. If you want to follow me on there, I'm gonna make it pretty soon. I made it yet. It's gonna be uh. It's gonna be on um, Twitch. Gonna be Hockey Kids. So same thing as my YouTube channel. Capital A Hockey, Capital K Kid with two D. So that's gonna be my name for um for Twitch. So I haven't made it yet, but I will. So make sure when I take you, I'll t I'll tell you guys if I if I made my uh, Twitch or not. So um yeah. So for right now, we are just just uh so many here. Looks like we're two three. Two three or three three and three for right now. Well, it looks like we are. So looks like we've had two shootout losses, one overtime loss, and one two three regulation losses. So there we go. We got a five one win against Toronto. Nobody's getting an injured so far, so really no excuses right here. Two and six Minnesota, and we win five and two. And last game of the month against the Buffalo Sabers. Who do we have? Who do we have? What do we get? Oh, an overtime loss. So right now, currently at the end of the month, we sit five, three, and four. So let's go back here to our division. Five, three, and four. And we currently sit second place in the division. Uh, it's just because we uh That's weird that Detroit not, that why that's weird. Why is Detroit behind us? Why are all those teams behind us? I get Tampa and Canadians because they're because they have uh, four losses, we only have three. But why is Detroit behind us? They only have two losses. Did we beat them head to head or something? I don't understand that. Why they're why they're ahead of us? I don't understand that. So uh, let's take a look right now for the very first month. Take a look at the standings. Oh, oh yes, that's. Oh no, I don't They were that back down. Sorry about that. So right now the division we said second. With 12 games played and 14 points, we're tied right now with the Buffalo Sabres. For our conference, however, where do we sit? We sit fourth right now. So right now, the playoffs started today, which we know either they don't. We currently play the Columbus Blue Jackets at home, who are right now one point behind us. But right now, Pittsburgh's on top with 14. New Jersey and uh, Buffalo, we're all up there with 14 points. Columbus, Detroit, Tampa, Montreal, Carolina, they're, they're all right now. So pretty much all right now have positive records. About 500 records. Um, New York, Washington, and then you get down to the teams like New York, Ottawa with one and nine record. These are teams that probably won't make the playoffs this year. I don't think so. I mean, who knows? It could have a late cherry. You get to go to the Eastern Western Conference. Excuse me. St. Louis, Colorado, uh, Los Angeles, Chicago, Anaheim, Dallas, Nashville, or Edmonton has a good record up there. Arizona, Winnipeg Jets at even, then you have teams like Vancouver, Calgary, Minnesota, uh, San Jose, and those teams with uh, not 500 records. And then the entire league right now, you have St. Louis Blues on top of that right now with 18 points. So overall, I feel pretty, a pretty good, uh, 
Uh, I'd say a pretty good month. I mean, I still don't get why Detroit's ahead of us. I still don't understand uh, why Detroit's behind us. I still don't understand that. Because they have a better record than us. But maybe we have more points. I don't know. Yeah, because we lost 3 nothing to them. And we lost in a shootout 5-4. So I don't know why we are ahead of them. I don't know. So we are going to soulmate up to... Oh, oh. We are going to soulmate... No. Oh, it's not there we go. Oh, my God. Do I keep showing over? All right, there we go. We're going to soulmate up to the very first game of the year. Oh, no. Very first game of the month. And then we are going to soulmate down to my favorite number, which is 19. So we're going to soulmate down to this, which I still got a couple more minutes left to go on this video. So right now, 5-3-4. and four, Pretty good. Sitting uh, second place in the division, fourth place in the conference. Not bad for the very first month. And a lot of losses there. So, luckily, those were mostly in overtime and in a shootout. No, only three of them were in regulation. So, we, we, we beat Ottawa there 4-1, to one, and we have a home stretch here against Florida, Edmonton, and New Jersey. And then we go on the road to face, and then we go on the road to face Toronto, Montreal. So, we beat Florida there 5-4. So, it seems to be pretty good right now. Now, we're getting together some wins, 7-3-4. and four. Let's see what else we can do here. Do we beat Edmonton? Yes, we did 2 0. So, Tuka Rask or whoever played in that game gets a shout out. 8 3 and 4 is our record right now. Unless Buffalo keeps winning, we should be moving up in the standings. Unless Buffalo, you know, keeps winning. Oof, New Jersey 10, 10 3 and 1. That's a pretty good record right there. Props to New Jersey. They didn't have a good year last year, especially in the real NHL. But we beat them there 4 3, we get 9 4. Toronto is pretty much an even matchup here. They have more regulation losses than us, but if we lose 3-2 in a close one, Montreal 10-6-1. They come in a hot streak. They win 10-2-1. So only are putting up three goals in a matter of two games. See what Carolina, see what we can do here against Carolina, who's has solid 508-8 record. And we beat them 3-1. Let's see what we can do here against the TJ Oshi, Elliott, and the St. Louis Blues, who are 13-4. And no Saint, no overtime or shootout losses. Let's see what we can do here. And we, oof, we lose in a shootout. So right now we currently sit at 10-5-5. Five five. Right now, and we still currently sit the second in the division. We moved past Buffalo, but we are behind Montreal, who has a 12-6 and six record. So, you know, so towards come up here towards the end of the month, you know, we're still second, second in the division. Let's see how we're doing here in the conference. Let's see how we're doing there. Second of the division, we know that. So let's see over here how we're doing in the conference. We currently move up to third. So we move past Pittsburgh. So right now, the playoffs are today. We play the Buffalo Sabres. So, uh, so Montreal still up there. New Jersey still up there. But we have... Oh, no, we're tied for points. I, come, I was at games played. So we have... Uh, me and him are tied... Uh, me and New Jersey are tied for, uh, for points. And Montreal has 26 as they lead the division. So, uh, yeah, guys, so this is going to be it for this episode of Boston Bruins GM mode. Um, so, as you can see, we still made it. Uh, we pretty much finished off the month of October, and we're halfway through the month of November. Here is our next game coming up in the 11 6 and 1 at the 11 6 and 1 Club with Blue Jackets. So, as you can see here, we pretty much still made the month of October, and we're pretty much midway through. Uh, we'll pretty much. Actually, we're passing the way through the month of November. So as you can see, coming up, we got Montreal. It could be a big game at home because, you know, we're still kind of chasing them in the division. Pittsburgh is right behind us in the conference. That's going to be a big game. And we're going on a Western Road swing here. Four Western Road teams that we're going to be facing off against. So, yeah, guys, this was it for the very first episode of Boston Bourbon's GM mode. Make sure you stay tuned. Again, try to push out some video for you guys. I'm going to have practice all week this week, so I'll try to push out a weekend video. But yeah, guys, until next time, thank you for joining me. This is Hockey Kid. I'm signing off. Peace.